In this lesson, we're going to learn how to use the internal 30 mm cannon. We will start the lesson in active pause mode. Under the forward fuselage of the SC-25T is a twin barrel GISH-20 30 mm cannon with a 200 round magazine. The 30 mm cannon round is armor piercing high explosive that is best against light armor and unarmored targets. The rounds include a tracer that you can use to better judge where the rounds are impacting. The firing rate is 3,000 rounds per minute with a muzzle velocity of 870 meters per second. You can turn on the cockpit lighting by pressing L. Press the space bar to continue. Go ahead and enable air to ground mode by pressing 7. To select a cannon as the active weapon, press C. With the cannon selected, take a look at the weapon status panel. In the bottom right corner is the indication for cannon rounds remaining. The K indicates a full magazine, and there are indications for half and one fourth. In the top right corner of the panel is the weapon type indicator that shows the cannon is selected. Press the spacebar to unpause the lesson and fly through all the gates ahead. Given that it's pretty dark out, you want to keep a close eye on your instruments and your radar altimeter on the HUD. We'll be flying pretty low, so make sure you don't get below the route altitudes. As before, fly through all the gates ahead, and we'll talk more about the gun as we get closer to the target. Watch your altitude at the next gate. It's a low one. On the HUD, you'll note that gun is displayed in the bottom left corner, indicating its selection. In the lower right corner of the HUD is a box that indicates the remaining ammunition quarters, four being full and one being one quarter full. <laughs> Along the left side of the HUD is the maximum and minimum range bars, just like we saw with rockets. When the range carries between the two bars, the cannon is within range of the point beneath the aiming reticle on the HUD. When in range, the LA indication will be displayed. We'll now start our dive on the target that consists of a couple of trucks marked with red smoke. To help aid you see in them, some illumination flares we dropped over the target area. Continue flying through the gates to line up with the target. Watch your airspeed and fly to place the aiming reticle over the target. Press the space bar when you get the LAQ.
105. Прошел ППМ-5 на 6000. Good hits on Tari. You can end the lesson now by pressing the escape key, or practice on the remaining targets marked with green smoke before the illumination flares die. 